First on the American health front, no matter how hard we try to fight the signs of aging, we can't slow it down or reverse it. Today, plastic surgery has gained mainstream popularity. The question is no longer if plastic surgery is an option, but rather, how do I choose the best plastic surgeon for me? Board-certified plastic surgery specialist in Boca Raton, Dr. Rafael Cabrera is highly respected among his peers and patients, giving him a reputation as the top facial plastic surgeon in Florida. His wealth of experience, precise surgical and non-surgical skills allow him to provide high-quality care using leading-edge technology and techniques so every patient can look and feel their best at any age. Plastic surgery is a very personal decision, particularly facial rejuvenation. But one thing that all the patients have in common is that they feel really good. And sometimes their inner selves don't match their outer selves. That face in the mirror just doesn't match. In men in particular, they look at their neck and their eyes and it makes them look older. For women, it could start younger where they have lights, a little bit of deflation or a loss of, of, of elasticity. Sometimes they have a lot of wrinkles because the skin has become so loose. Women older in their 60s may have aging that encompasses their eyes and their foreheads as well. A facelift is one of the most popular choices to treat facial aging. Dr. Cabrera is highly trained in all types of facelift surgery. Well, a facelift has been the mainstay for facial rejuvenation for over 100 years, and with good reason. It works. Now, what we have learned since the 80s is that the muscle layer inside the face has to be managed. What I have learned in the last 20 years and what I feel for me is a real evolution is understanding that the face ages from up to down and the neck from back to front. As a result, you have to take the muscle layer and treat it as if it's two separate layers. I call this a dual vector approach and I call this a smarter lift. Not so much the lift, me being smarter. Well, in addition to a smarter lift, which is my favorite type of face lift, I often add fat grafting. Fat grafting is a way to replace volume that's naturally lost over time. One of the big advantages of fat grafting is that you also get to replace adipose-derived stem cells, which theoretically will make your skin look younger. In addition to that, of course, the eyes and the brow and the lips all need to be addressed. They can be addressed with surgical procedures or with non-invasive procedures. And don't forget the skin. The skin is always to be taken care of. A good skin care regimen is the cornerstone of facial rejuvenation. Dr. Cabrera is unique because he doesn't just give you a facelift. He addresses other aesthetic needs as well. For men, the problem usually lies in the neck and in the eyes. It can make us look old and tired, and most importantly, without energy. So by correcting the neck, getting a nice clean jawline, and making the eyes look fresh, it's a real transformation. For younger women, it usually lies with just a small amount of deflation and maybe some early laxity. Here's where some fat grafting can really make a difference. In another patient where they just had a lot of loose skin, a smarter lift really fits the bill and they can get rid of almost all of their wrinkles just with one surgical procedure. For the older patient, they can still get beautiful results. They may need a little bit more in terms of having their eyes done or perhaps their brow and other things as well. Dr. Rafael Cabrera and his experienced team help you put your best face forward.